Greetings, Barracudas. My name is Natasha Love, and I am the CEO of YOLO. With me today, I have my partner, Charles Long, our CFO, and we also have our management team here. Coquita McGee, our Director of Sustainability, Miranda Ward, Director of Operations, and Bronwyn Moran, our Director of Marketing. Today, we would like to present to you our business proposal for our ultralight portable stove. My senior year of college, I had the opportunity to travel to India for an economic convention. It proved to be one of the most memorable and life-changing trips of my life. While there, I had the opportunity to visit the Dahari slum in Mumbai, India, pictured here. It's about approximately one square mile in size and it's home to approximately one million people. Now, to look at it, it doesn't seem like much. In fact, it's a little depressing, but this happens to be one of the most productive slums in the entire world. Here in DeHarvey, this group of uneducated poor residents have taken recycling and manufacturing to an exponential level, and they have created a self-sustaining community and ecosystem that is home to over 7,000 businesses and it generates over $450 million in revenues every year. The people in this slum have literally turned trash into treasure. And despite their impoverished condition, they still take time to make giving back to their community a priority. My visit to the DeHarvey slum, coupled with a course I later took in sustainable accounting, was a source of motivation for me to build a company that used sustainability as a driver for profitability. More companies are starting to realize that social, environmental, and economic issues of the world are not just the sole responsibility of the government. And businesses, both large and small, have to do their part to address these concerns. And it can be done in a way that it proves to be a source of differentiation and profitability if done right. Here at YOLO, we aim to do just that and set the standard in the camping industry, and we hope you will partner with us to make sustainability profitable. Today, we will share with you our statement of need. We will introduce our company, describe our product, and provide you with a market and financial analysis. Afterwards, we hope that you will be excited to partner with us and help, help YOLO set a new standard in the camping industry, one that uses sustainability to drive its profits. I will start with the statement of need. I will begin with giving you some camping industry statistics, identify consumer product needs as well as environmental concerns, and end by detailing the benefits that can be expected from our product. An independent study done by Campgrounds of America reports that more than 1 million new households have started camping each year since 2014. Currently, there are 75 million U.S. households that are active campers, and 13 million of those households plan to camp more this year than they did in 2017. Millennials is really driving this growth. They are currently 38% of campers, and that is expected to increase to 50% over the next year. There is also much more diversity among campers. It has grown to include African Americans, Asians, and Hispanic campers, with the youngest group being the most diverse. There also is an eco-friendly trend among campers to camp without leaving a trace, and they use the model, take nothing but pictures, leave nothing but footprints. This desire to leave little impact on camping locations is becoming more and more popular. An environmental issue that is closely related to campers' desire to camp without leaving a trace is the growing levels in our landfills. Many are nearing capacity. It has been found that many biodegradable products don't actually break down due to conditions in our landfills. Some cities are moving towards a goal of zero waste through a plan of recycling, reduction, reuse, and composting. Just last week, members in Forsyth County came out to fight the expansion of the Eagles Point landfill due to conditions they have to endure living in such close proximity to it. YOLO is passionate about educating our community on the environment 
in helping them reduce their carbon footprint and contribution to growing waste levels one can at a time. We have started a recycling rewards program that promotes the importance of recycling and encourages individuals to donate their used cans. Our stove is also made from recycled cans and completely recyclable upon disposal. The fuel we recommend is also contained in a recyclable container and it prevents additional waste from being added to our landfills. YOLO has redesigned the traditional portable outdoor stove and created a product that's eco-friendly, lightweight, and at a lower cost than our competitors. Our product does not require the use of firewood. It doesn't disturb the natural environment. It also can use multiple types of fuel, allowing for flexibility. The recommended fuel comes in a container where you can see how much is left, and this allows for more efficient planning. Our stove is significantly lighter in weight than other portable stoves, which is helpful for backpackers and campers who have to carry all of their supplies over sometimes rough terrain. The 2014 American Campers Report showed that new and experienced campers alike consider a portable stove as one of their must-have items on their packing list, and they typically buy or borrow one for their first camping trip. They tend to require replacement every three years. A 2016 national survey of campers listed price, eco-friendly features, product size and weight, and ease of assembly and use as the most important factors that are considered when making a purchase. YOLO has created a product that exceeds the competition in each of these areas. Now, we will have Coquita McGee tell you more about our company background. Hello, my name is Coquita McGee and I am the Director of Sustainability for YOLO. I'm here today to give you our company's background information. YOLO is the story of two young people with a dream. YOLO is a young company, but the founders have created a product that is sure to take the camping industry by storm. YOLO was founded in 2016 by Charles Young and Natisha Love, college seniors who felt that they had a new product that would be affordable and eco-friendly. They often went camping with a group of other college students, and they all had a passion for the environment and a desire to camp without leaving a trace. The camping trips often consisted of sharing stories and social drinking. On one camping trip, Charles looked at all the trash the group had accumulated, and he noticed that 90% of the trash consisted of empty beer and soda cans. YOLO was started because Charles and Natisha wanted to provide lightweight, eco-friendly camping products that support backpackers and survivalists desires to camp without a trace. YOLO is a small company and it consists of the founders and three friends from college. YOLO consists of Charles Young, who is the CFO, Natisha Love, who is the CEO, Bronwyn Moran serves as the Director of Marketing. I, Coquina McGee, I'm the Director of Sustainability. And Miranda Wood is the Director of Operations. Thank you for listening to our background information. And next will be Miranda Wood giving you a description of our products. Thank you. This section is designed to provide an understanding of our premier product, an alcohol stove. It is a lightweight stove made from recycled aluminum cans intended to transform the way people cook while experiencing the great outdoors. Our repurposed can stove is about three inches tall, three inches wide, and only weighs eight grams. The price of our stove is $5. One way we can keep our prices so low include our reward program. Our reward program encourages our customers to recycle cans to earn rewards per can they donate. Another great benefit of our stove is that it can burn any type of flammable liquid, including fingernail polish remover. However, after research and development, it was clear that heat provides the cleanest and best burn. To demonstrate how clean of a burn heat provides, we're going to look at a few images of a stove. 
As you can realize in this image, you can barely see a flame, if you can even see it at all. Immediately after that image, we turned off the light and retook a picture of the same stove, making these two images only 60 seconds apart. <gasps> Look! The flame is actually real! Also, you might notice that this flame is blue and not red. A blue flame means complete combustion, which is a sign of a cleaner burn. The opposite, of course, is the yellow or red flame, which is what we imagine for a fire. However, yellow flames create a soot known as the smoke of a fire. Blue flames do not create any type of soot or smoke, and therefore are a cleaner way of cooking food in the wilderness or burning any fire. Next, we'll see how the stove works while reviewing what makes YOLO great. We value the significance of strategically planning each phase of our business. We accomplish this by focusing on the factors that affect our success and our setbacks. Our first product has several strengths that will allow us to thrive in the marketplace. Our weight is 90% lower than our competitors, our fuel is easy to use and allows for less waste. Our price is $5, which is also 90% less than our competitors, while our rewards program helps keep production costs low and our margins high. Our, su our success has given fuel to our strengths. However, we do still face a few weaknesses. We are a new company with little financial reserves, few employees, and other startup challenges. However, with your investment, those weaknesses can further be extinguished. Also, as for our stove, it is possible that it could be crushed if not properly stored, or due to its small size, it could be tipped over while not in use. With continued growth, we have the opportunity to encourage more environmentally friendly behaviors while also confidently expanding our product line. Our company can use our stoves to help the needy have a warm meal or even a clean meal, while our company also grows exponentially. We are threatened by high levels of competition in the marketplace and a lack of a patent. Currently, several companies provide a portable outdoor cooking stove. These are stoves made by the big names in the industry, such as JetBoil, Espec, Fargo, and MSR. This MSR stove is the closest commercially sold stove to what we sell. These stoves, and as you see, it's $45. These stoves require a canister attachment for fuel, which is a non-recycled item with limited usage and increased weight. All of these stoves require routine maintenance, which costs anywhere between $20 and $50, and the stove itself, as you see, is anywhere between $45 to $90. Yellow's advantage of the competition includes the fuel flexibilities, low cost, and zero maintenance. However, penny stoves do exist, and people sell them in places like Etsy shops. They have a very similar design, except it requires an actual penny to sit on top to function. This causes many issues for the user. While their sales are so small, and they're not sold commercially, they pose little threat to yellow. In addition to the stove, YOLO is working on developing other eco-friendly outdoor accessories. Our waterproof backpack and a gravity water-carrying filtration system are the products closest to being released. The waterproof backpack is half the weight of the competitors while maintaining YOLO's user-friendly and eco-friendly approach. The gravity water carrying filtration system would be a new product to the market with no direct competitor. The system provides an easy way of drinking clean water from any stream, river, or lake by placing the water in a gravity bag that is connected to a water filtration system. Although we have several other products, these are the two that will hit the market first. Next, we'll hear from Bronwyn about the market analysis. Hello, my name is Bronwyn Moran and I'm the marketing director here at YOLO. I'm going to discuss our target market, our marketing mix, and our web presence. 
Our target market is located in a 50 mile radius to downtown Carrollton, Georgia. Carrollton, Georgia is approximately one hour from Atlanta. Our target market is 18 years and older. Both males and females make up our target market. I found that our target market lives an active lifestyle. They are minimalist, adventurous, and practical. Now I'm going to discuss our marketing mix. Our product is an ultra lightweight portable stove made from beverage cans. Beverage cans that are consumed and empty that are uncrushed. It's affordable at just $5. Our competitors charge $50 or more for their portable soaps. Our stove is a source of energy and allows the user to choose from several fuel options. It is extremely accessible for locals. We have a direct channel of distribution. Our store is located in Carrollton, Georgia. You can find more information on our website or in our brochure. Right now we have a recycling rewards program that offers points for those that donate cans. For each can that is donated, one point is earned. If a customer earns 100 points, they may receive a can at no cost. This, is, this rewards program is expected to be temporary, but it has proved to be very successful so far. Now I'm going to discuss YOLO's web presence. Our website can be reached at yolo.com, Y-O-L-O.com. On our website, you can find more information on our product, our store, and our contact information. Our web presence has been steadily growing and our website has attracted nearly 25,000 users. We aren't currently doing sales online, but hope to in the future. We're really excited about the direction our company is going and hope you are too. Next, you're gonna hear from Charles, our CFO, and he will discuss YOLO's financial details. Thank you. Hello, Barracudas. My name is Charles Long and I am the Chief Financial Officer for YOLO. In this section, I will provide financial information to show you that YOLO is worth your investment dollars based on careful data analysis. We will evaluate costs, forecast sales growth, and the need for your investment dollars. Information in this section details the total cost incurred to sustain the production of YOLO stove for 2016. Our initial costs include legal fees in $2,260, website development for $3,000, marketing expenses for $7,740, $45,000 in salaries, and $2,000 for miscellaneous expenses. Our total cost is $60,000. Barracudas, what I have here is a brief overview of our operating cost. With your investment, we intend to start manufacturing for year 2017. As you can see here, our current total labor cost is $2 per unit with a gross margin of $3 per stove. With your support of investment, we will gain 60% reduction in cost of goods sold, which will allow us to increase our gross profit margin by 40%. Now we move on to our sales growth. Based on our analysis, we anticipate a steady growth rate across the board. In terms of units produced, please pay attention to the above chart. With your support, we will increase our capacity and be more efficient with our production. We will produce more than 94,000 units within the manufacturing year of 2017. This volume will enable us to satisfy our reoccurring purchase orders and allow us to meet the demands of the market, as shown in our market analysis. Moving on, last year our sales amounted to $150,000. Compared to this year, you can see that if we continue to sell at $5 per stove, this will yield a sales of more than $471,000. If our labor cost is $0.80 cents per unit, then we make a profit of more than $330,000. Compared to our performance in the previous year, this makes a huge difference, and we expect a continued substantial profit into the following years. So now, let's talk about our investment needs. As mentioned, our company is seeking an outside investment of $200,000 in exchange for 25% equity in YOLO. Reoccurring monthly purchase orders exceed our current capacity, therefore we need this investment to produce more. As for our market analysis, there is a need for our product and there is a market that is willing to pay for it. We as management will reinvest our own funds in the amount of $30,000 in order to ensure our company's continued success. The combination of your investment and ours will amount 
to $230,000. We will allocate the investment as depicted in the chart above. These are the allocations. $33,000 will be used to promote our rewards program. $15,000 will be used to purchase necessary materials for production. $40,000 will be used to market our business online through Amazon and Facebook. $35,000 will be used to train new staff. $60,000 will be used to purchase manufacturing equipment so that production can be more efficient. $45,000 will be used to secure a production facility. And the remaining $2,000 will be used to cover all minor operating expenses. Now that you have this in front of you, let me just guarantee you and assure you that every dollar of your investment will be accounted for. Now I pass this on to my colleague, Marina Wood, for a close. The YOLO team would like to thank you for giving us the opportunity to share our proposal with you and allowing us to introduce you to our ultralight portable stove. Our product is just what the camping industry needs and there is a large market of consumers willing and ready to pay for our product. Our company is a great investment and we feel that we have found our niche with our ultralight stoves that are made from recycled materials that are recyclable upon disposal and completely eco-friendly. In conclusion, we have given you an in-depth look at our company and we hope that you choose YOLO as worthy of your investment. YOLO is seeking $200,000 in exchange for 25% equity in an effort to start manufacturing to meet the high demand of our product, expand and incorporate online sales. The expansion will allow YOLO to widen product distribution and increase market share, which will equal a return on your investment. An investment in YOLO is an investment in you, the future, and our planet. We are YOLO. You only live once. So pack ultra light and travel without a trace. Thank you. Next, we will be answering questions. Long term, we would love to have national distribution of our product and national expansion of our recycling rewards program. Being in the camping industry, one that relies on customers being able to go out and enjoy the natural environment, I believe it is our responsibility to make sure that we address environmental concerns. Creating a company that uses sustainability as a driver for profits was my initial motivation for this company. And long term, it is our goal to be an industry leader and set the standard in providing sustainable products that help our customers to decrease their carbon footprint and travel without leaving a trace. Do you really need this investment? And the answer to your question is, yes, we need this investment because we are currently in a position that most businesses would love to be in. We can't make our products fast enough to meet the demand without your investment. Investing in our company will definitely get you guaranteed return on your investment. And it will allow us to get one step closer in reaching our goal of becoming a national company in the next five years. Barracudas, you have asked us how much did our company make this year and how much is projected for next year. This year, our sales hit $150,000 and we made a profit of $30,000. For next year, we project sales to hit $471,000, so we expect a profit of $335,000. The question was, how could another target market use your product? Survivalists and preppers would find a great use in a YOLO stove. YOLO stoves don't require electricity, and survivalists could use them either as a light source or for cooking. Our alcohol stove is going to make money because there is no one doing what we are doing. There is no clean and affordable cooking method in our market. We create a solution that gives everyone with any budget the ability to enjoy the great outdoors 
and we fulfill a need of the ultralight backpacking community by providing the lightest stove sold commercially. Therefore, everyone who camps, hikes, or just simply loves the outdoors will buy and use our products because we are one of a kind.